Hey everyone, James Reeves, TFB TV, SHOT Show 2023. Actually, not quite SHOT Show 2023. This is Beretta Range Day, which is the day before SHOT Show kind of officially kicks off. Beretta has so many new and exciting things this year. They've got their own Range Day. And one of the most exciting things, in my opinion, is the new Beretta 80X. You guys saw my preview video for this that ran today. And now we've got like the official, official copy of it. What I was shooting was a prototype in Italy, but this is the real deal. Hello everybody, my name is Graham Kohlmeyer. I'm the Director of Product Management for Beretta USA. I oversee all the product management and development of the firearms uh, for the US commercial market. So really excited to bring you the ADX Cheetah. Uh, this is a great collaboration between the US and Italy uh, in the development teams to bring this over here as sort of the reimagination of a legendary platform and the reinvigoration of the 380 platform from Beretta. So really, really excited to bring this over. And what you're looking at here is the launch edition. So the launch edition is gonna come with a bronze anodized frame, an Inox barrel, black slide, okay? So we will have uh, other variants as well, like an all black version, mm -hmm. Um, and then we'll probably play around with some color options in the future. Yeah, we saw, like, I saw the green one up there. The it looked really good. There. I, I, I saw the all black one when I was in Italy. I thought it looked great. So all three of these are going to look really good with the color combos. And there might even be more after that, right? There probably will be, yeah. We're playing around with a lot of different options. I think what we're really going for here is a pistol that has a lot more fashion in it, right? Um, really playing up, like, the style aesthetic. Um, that is Beretta. Yeah, why? I mean, why? Why did uh, somebody said, "Hey, look, you know, 380 is a lot of people regard it as something that's in the past. You know, nine is the new deal. Even you know, 30 Super Carry is uh, was almost an attempt to kind right. of oust the 380. So why the 380? Why do this? 380 has a lot of great advantages, right? Number one, recoil impulse, fantastic. Um, you can do the direct blowback system, which is highly reliable, right? Um, you also have a lighter recoil spring. So if you have uh, challenges with racking slides um, or you just don't have the strength for a nine millimeter, especially in a gun this small, because the smaller you go, the, the harder the spring has to be, mm -hmm. right? So like, so that's where all of this comes in and it culminates in a gun that like, you know, we were really, really thinking about the women's carry market when we built this, mm -hmm. okay? And the reason for that is, is what we've seen over the past few years is micro compacts getting smaller and smaller and smaller and less and less pleasurable to shoot, mm -hmm. right? So nine millimeter micro compact, great for concealability. You got nine millimeter, you've got high caps now, right? Not particularly enjoyable to shoot, right? So what we wanted was we wanted to mesh the enjoyability of being able to take a gun to the range as well as the concealability of being able to carry it and be able to shoot it frequently. And, and don't sell yourself short here, because when you say like something that is enjoyable to shoot, it means right. enjoyable to, to shoot well. This is right. not only much more pleasant to shoot, but easier to shoot effectively than say like an ultra compact single stack 380 exactly. uh, with a two inch barrel, right? And uh, this is going to be more accurate and easier to shoot. I'm glad to see you do it. You say you had the ladies carry market in mind, but yep. you know, you're gonna lock down the metrosexual concealed carry market because I'm buying one of these bad boys. I love it. Tell me about the features. We're talking with the magazine, 13 plus one sure. capacity of 380. Is this gonna use Beretta 84 magazines? No, so this is a newly designed magazine. Um, the reason we did that is because we've changed the geometry for modern ammunition, yeah. right? So the feed ramp uh, will, will better feed hollow points, right? Um, so we've changed that geometry and therefore we changed the magazine in order to increase reliability, right? So that's one part of this. Uh, the other part of this that's the really the highlighting feature is the trigger, right? So we really took uh, a lot of learnings from the Beretta 92X performance, uh, and we've integrated those learnings in here in terms of surface finishes, coatings. So we've changed up a lot of the coatings, um, and, and all of this has come from a lot of the development that we've done in the performance market as well as in the military, right? To drive highest reliability and best performance, best feeling, all of that, right? So. So what we have here is we've sort of uh, taken and scaled down our performance trigger. So what you're gonna find is a really, really nice, smooth double action trigger pull and a very quick reset on the, on the single action, okay? So, so this is um, sort of the highlighting feature of this gun is the trigger, 
And that's something where I think it's, it's unique in the market to have, number one, if you don't really trust uh, striker fired guns because there is no manual safety, then you have that double action trigger pull is sort of that a little bit of extra comfort, right? A little bit of extra time to think, uh, as well as you've got your frame safety with the decock, right? right? So you've got these two sort of safety features built into this that, that you know, if you are just getting into carry, um, this creates a really nice platform to give you a little bit of extra confidence in carrying your gun, right? especially if you're carrying off body, okay? So pick a tinny rail. Pick rail, yep. The sawtooth forward and rear slide serrations. Absolutely, got to press. Optics readiness. Optics right? ready. Optics and ready. How's this going to work? A plate system, I imagine. Plate system. Yep. Is so, it going to come with the plates? No, plates will be available aftermarket. Obviously, we would love for everything to come with plates, um, but it's a little bit cost prohibitive. Yeah. Right. Um, that said, this is not exactly an entry level gun. Mm -hmm. Right. This is right. definitely carrying a premium price point. Um, so, you know, and what is that price point going to be? So the price point where we're going to be putting this out, the launch edition will be at a 999 price point MSRP. Um, and the standard edition black variant um, will be at 849. Okay. So by no means an entry level gun, but when you look at the premium features of this, when you look at the ergonomics, factor in that it goes through all of the quality processes, all of the, the, the critical steps in Beretta Italy, and it's imported. Um, it just makes for a fantastic package, still a significant value in the market, especially for people who want to get into a gun that is both a carry gun as well as an enjoyable gun to shoot. That's our biggest thing here is the enjoyability of being able to shoot this gun on a regular basis and then also carry it. Sure. And you probably don't know this off the top of your head, but what are we talking in terms of weight? Like 20, probably the low 20. Yeah. So we're looking at mid 20 ounce yeah. weight, right? So I think we're coming in right around 26 ounces uh -huh. on the weight um, unloaded. So not the lightest gun in the world, um, but you but I mean, that's not aluminum frame. Yeah, sure. Right? You, with an aluminum yeah. frame, you're still talking about like the same weight as most compact polymer exactly. carry guns. So that makes sense to me. When are they going to come out? So we are launching these a shot, uh, mm. starting to take orders. They will be shipping from Italy in March and April. Mm -hmm. So we will be hitting the street in April with these. Okay. Yeah. And I personally can't wait. The first ones that are going to come out, the bronze and the black, and then Correct. other colors to follow. Correct. Uh, do you know what mounting plates are going to be available at, at launch? Optics mounting for the EDX Cheetah, uh, plate system, uh, plates that will be available uh, for purchase at launch uh, will be compatible with the Hollow Sun 407K, uh, the Shield RMSC, and the Dr. Noblex. So. Perfect. Graham, thank you so much for taking time out of your day to speak with us about this. Thanks for having us Absolutely. here at Beretta Range Day. This is. It might be, we're going to see by the end of SHOT Show, there's a lot of cool things, but this might be my number one SHOT Show gun. Guys, stay tuned. We're bringing you more from Beretta Range Day and SHOT Show.